started out in the western suburbs Came across on that ten pound plan Starting up a brand new life in a brand new land It is a suburb of many faces From the fishing boats rocking gently at anchor on the Maribyrnong River Across the park to Flemington Where the nation stops for a horse race on the first Tuesday in November from the top of the Westgate Bridge, the growth of Footscray can be seen in all its glory. Footscray, the football club, embraces the western suburbs. It's been a magnet for players and business for the last 67 years. It draws its support from the newly settled areas around Werribee, Laverton and Eltona. The historic early Victorian settlement of Williamstown on its picturesque point. Out through the industrial suburbs of Brooklyn and Sunshine. Footscray has always been a working man's suburb, an area that has been proudly blue collar, a suburb that has serviced the meatworks that thrived in the area, the dock on its periphery, and the markets, be it fruit or fish, that line the roads from the city of Melbourne. The town hall at Footscray is merely a few kilometres from the heart of the city. It might well be a world away. When we headed out to the western oval, had a dream, red, white and blue Our Teddy Witten, how I looked up to you The district that produced a string of homegrown champions like Mr Football Ted Witten, ruck giant Gary Dempsey, Premiership captain Charlie Sutton and in recent years skipper Dougie Hawkins has become distinctly cosmopolitan. The post-war migrants settled there in their thousands and the Greeks and Italians of the 50s have given way to the Vietnamese in the 80s and early 90s. The Western Oval is blessed with some of the greatest views of any sporting ground in the country, but the club itself has known both good and very bad times. The highlight most certainly was 1954, when the Bulldogs led by Captain Courageous, the tough and tenacious Charlie Sutton, took the flag for the first and only time, defeating Melbourne. They returned to the MCG for the grand final in 1961 under the leadership of Ted Whitten, but they succumbed to Hawthorne. The Hawks winning their first flag in the first encounter between the new boys of the league at grand final level. They came from the class of 1925. Over recent years, there's been a battle to survive. A merger with Fitzroy nearly ended the club's existence, but the Bulldogs were saved after a long and patriotic battle against the VFL by devoted locals. The club's finances were revamped, and under President Peter Gordon, Footscray has the blueprints to make the Western Oval once again the sporting focal point of the Western suburbs. Heading back west just to hear them bull 